In Iowa, it only happens every 17 years. To see them swarming and certainly hear them buzzing from miles away. Our Vanessa Ping joins us live with more on this rare occurrence. Vanessa? Kevin and Stacey, that's right. We're talking about cicadas. Now they're one of Mother Nature's phenomenons, and soon they will be swarming all over central Iowa. Just like their parents 17 years ago, most people didn't know they were right beneath their feet, waiting patiently and quietly. They've been underground, in the dark, counting from 1 to 17 very slowly. Slowly feeding on tree sap, growing into adults. Then the wait is over and they emerge. The racket is horrendous. The noise they make just presses in on you. Only the males make the noise as a way to attract females. It's annoying, but it's one of nature's miracles. They come out in these huge mass emergences of anywhere from 10 to 20,000 cicadas per tree. In Iowa, periodical cicadas only emerge every 17 years in late May and June. Scientists say the long life cycle helps them outlive their predators, and when they do emerge, there's so many of them, predators won't be able to eat all of them. You'll see the swarm of them just sort of flying from tree to tree. You'll find and hear them in permanent forests like Ledges State Park. The locusts will only live for six weeks, leaving behind yet another generation of cicadas, which you'll have to wait until 2031 to see. This is our year to get to see it. Other good viewing spots are Greenwood Park and the Salisbury House in Des Moines and also the Iowa Arboretum in near Madrid. And by the way, Kevin, just so there is no confusion, the uh, excuse me, periodical cicadas are black bodies. They have black bodies unlike the annual cicadas, which are grayish green in color. Either one's really ugly. <laughs> <laughs> That's the That's thank you. True. <laughs>